town. Used to get lots of visitors. Not anymore. <clears throat> Have you found victory yet, Rangers? Tell me. Dealt with? How? <laughs> He's done enough damage as it is. He was my heir, if you can believe it, until I realized he was never going to grow out of hurting people. Exiling him was the best of two bad options. The families wanted his head. Still, anyway, I promised you a reward. Here it is. Now, what else? Talk, then. Can you blame me? If she wasn't as bloody-handed as she is brave, I'd have already passed the throne to her. Unfortunately, she has no interest in governing, only ruling. Used to be my strongest supporters, until we had an argument about how quickly democracy should be instituted in Colorado. When they lost that argument, they tried to usurp me, and, well, until they attacked the city, I thought I'd wiped out the whole family. Apparently, Neelius led some of them into the wilderness. I should have been more thorough. I assume it was Liberty who put them up to the raid. They were never this clever before. Fine. You expect me to care more this time than I did last time? What's the complaint now? Nelius. I always planned to turn this nation over to the people when it was stronger. But Nelius refused to wait. He called for revolution. Turned family against family. Weakened us. I couldn't allow that. The survival of Colorado is more important than one family. Or one idea. Get going, Rangers. You have work to do.
inside!
are you bold enough to make the dangerous trek across the wasteland to reach the city? Can you discover the AI's secret weakness and defeat the robots? If you crave adventure, the Colorado Springs Gaming Club wants you. We play Robots and Rangers every Tuesday night, and we're looking for a few heroes to join our party. We've got the rules and the dice. All we need is your imagination. Oh. Rangers! Rangers, you came! We're in dire straits here. Those twisted psychopaths want us all dead. You gotta help us. They done camped out at the side door on the right. Won't keep them out long. It's our breeding pen and most of our bison are in there. They must have noticed us trying to reinforce it and decided it was the best way in. Them crazies were demanding our bison to turn him into weapons of war. Sick fucks wanted to graft machine parts onto him or something. When they started machining him up, the bison fought back. They don't like to be messed with and they're damn fierce. Masters had their hands full, for sure. I'll show you the way, but I am done as soon as we see them. They're crazy! Follow me! The sick bastards are up there. I'll just hang on back while you take care of things. Wouldn't want to get in the way. Rangers, what do you want? This has nothing to do with you. Piss off, Rangers. You have no say in this matter. We will take what is ours. Then you will die with them! Shoot! They saw us!
Nice job you done there, Rangers. And since you're taking care of us, it's only fitting we take care of you. We could send some meat over to your HQ every so often. Sound good? Oh, thank you, Rangers. Any chance you can clear some vermin off the ranch before they go after one of our bison? Well, all sorts of critters find their way to the bison from time to time, trying for a meal. Now, we usually keep them away, but with us being occupied lately, some made their way out back to the bison's watering hole. Can you help us clear them out? Thanks, Rangers. I knew we could rely on y'all. Last we saw, they were out on the ice floe out back. We take our bison out there to drink, so those vermin are a bit of a problem. Well, I'll leave you to it and go tend to the bison. Poor girls need some calming down. You come find me when those vermin are dealt with.
it! Thanks, dude! for clearing out those vermin. We'll be happy to send you the finest of our bison meat to your headquarters. 